to those raising the Palestinian flag, where were you when ISIS was launched in the name of Islam and beheaded tens of thousands of Arabs in Libya, Syria, and Iraq? Why didn't you take it to the streets and raise their flags and condemn the terror and call for a ceasefire? Where were you when Arab dictators and terrorists killed hundreds of thousands of Arabs in Syria and Libya? Why didn't you take it to the streets then? and raise the Syrian and Libyan flags and condemn the terror and call for a ceasefire? Where were you in the last decade when Saudi Arabia, backed by other Arab countries, killed and starved out more than 400,000 Yemenis, my country? I didn't see any of you take to the streets or raise the Yemeni flag or condemn the terror or call for a ceasefire. This calls for some self-reflection. When millions of Arabs are slaughtered by other Arabs, you say absolutely nothing. But when 7,000 Arabs are killed by Jews defending their right to exist, you revolt, you get angry, you raise the flag, you condemn the terror, you call for a ceasefire, you turn the world upside down. Why is that? Why were you so silent then, but so loud now? Can it be that you are finally raising a flag and creating chaos because you only hate that the perpetrators are Jews? Because you obviously don't care when millions of Arabs are killed by Arabs. Can it be that you storming the streets is just you venting out your hatred towards Jews? The same hatred that we learned by our mosques and schools? You often speak of numbers and proportionality, but by the rules of proportionality, you should not be raising the Palestinian flag. Unless there's another agenda at play. Jew hatred. Or as I like to call it, hatred.